I thought I'd come in and tell you before you see it for yourself. They found him, haven't they? No. But, you know, they've been looking where they found the car. They're just extending the search to the woods by the river, so hopefully it should turn up. I'm sorry. It's okay. I got shot. Shouldn't even be here. Um, this is Calvin, and I'm glad you told me. Told you what? Sorry, it's none of my business. I just thought it might have been about Sean. It was. Oh, no, they haven't. No, they haven't. Listen, Claire, I really don't want to talk about this. It must be an absolute nightmare. Can I book you in for an appointment? <clears throat> Have you got a minute? Yeah, what's up? Warren, they're still searching for Sean's body. They're starting to look in Rushmore Woods by the river. What are they looking in there for? Well, I don't know, do I? But as of tomorrow, forensics are going to be everywhere searching for bits of Sean's body and I don't know whether I can take it. What's up? Are you okay? Have you finished in there? For now. Uh, can you just give us ten minutes? It's all right. I just, um, I keep thinking about all the fun the three of us used to have. And I know that he screwed us both over, but he doesn't deserve this. Yeah, I know. But then there's probably people out there who wouldn't agree. People we don't even know. And what about you? We've been through this before. Why'd you have to keep going on about it? I'm sorry, but it just keeps coming back to me. You wanted to get rid of him. Yeah. And I did. You sent him packing with a big bag of my cash, remember? <laughs> Why did this happen? Gives you all the best jobs. Coming as a laugh. Don't be like that. Us two need to stick together. We're good together. Yeah, well, where's Warren? He's upstairs with Calvin. Sweating his bits off, and I know you know why. I can see it in your face. But I've already told you. Come on. We know each other better than that. Mm, look, what if he comes in here? I just told you he's busy. He's got much bigger things on his mind. It's a murder investigation. Has that been stuck in with you yet? Look, Sean was a friend of yours. Don't try and act the bigger. Just pull your snout out and go. Oh, you think you're such a big man, don't you? Listen, was there anything else? Only I'm getting a little bit bored of these interruptions. So that's it. You really want to know what I think? It couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. Now I've got a club to run. You said romance was dead. I've never heard a knocking. There's a law against perving in the toilets. There's a law against cradle snatching too. Just ask his ex. That's right. You can't, can you? Oh, come on, that's out of order. Ah! Uh, uh, no! You're the one who's out of order. You! Sort yourself out. Because me and you are going to go and have a little chat. And uh, maybe this time you're going to listen. Uh, does the word trust not mean anything to you? <laughs> or does that go out the window as soon as some slapper gives you the go ahead? I'm sorry, mate. <laughs> I just... What? Let your brain take a trip down south? Yeah. So how long's it been going on? There's nothing going on. Look, this was the first time, I swear. Oh, yeah? Anything you're not telling me? You know what Claire's like, she, she, she was in my face. Yeah, 
Well, we've all been there. Yeah. Yeah! But I told you to leave well alone. Are you either with me? Or you're not? I'm with you, mate, I swear. It's just... Just meet me here in an hour. I've got a little job for you tonight. What, what job? I thought you said you were with me. I am. But then it doesn't matter, does it? It's about time you learn a little bit about loyalty. <laughs> 